Greetings to my fellow Peace Blunderers and welcome to my new video where we're going to actively try losing within the first two moves. Yes, as whites, theoretically, you can get mated as early as move two if you start doing some ridiculous stuff. But let's see how many players in and around 1200 range can actually spot the mate in practice. The format is, as per usual, an unrated 10 minute rapid game and honestly, I don't know what to expect. The point of this research is sort of test the waters a little bit and see how good the tactics tactical vision of the players of this rating range actually is. And if you just so happen to find this video useful, please like and subscribe, it helps me out massively. Love you. Okay, 1256 from the Philippines, let's go. G4, A5, please, please, yes! And now, let's hang the mate in 2 with F3. The mate in 2 is delivered with Queen H4. And let's see if they spot it. No, they didn't. <laughs> okay, okay, that's the first one lost immediately. Well, I decided that the opponent is going to get a point from me only if they spot the mate immediately. After that, you know, it doesn't really count, but we're going to give him an extra chance with knight c3 maybe. Let's see what they do now. If they don't deliver mate, it's not going to count for sure. Come on, mate, this is your last chance. No, they don't! Oh. Okay, okay, well that's one gone. On to the next one. 1265 from, what is it, Morocco, Tunisia? Oh, what? Hong oh, bloody hell, Hong Kong. I just embarrassed myself, sorry. Uh, they do look a bit alike from afar. Well, I apologize. G4, let's hope for E5. Unless they're bored or play something else. Well, they shouldn't. Please, E5. E6 will also do. E6 will also do, it's fine. As long as you push the E pawn to free up your queen, I'll be perfectly happy with that. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so how can we make this work still? I'm still gonna play F3, why not? I'm going to see if after, let's see if they see the mate now. I think it's gonna still count if they do the mate now. Yes, and they did it! Congratulations! Congratulations, that's one out of two! That's one out of two. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Good job, good job. Paul Marcus, good one. Okay, Mono Reborn, 1438 from Great Britain! Okay, J4, hoping for E6, E5 most likely, yet again. Well, honestly, I don't play Grob. <laughs> I wouldn't know the theory, but I would imagine that e5 is the strongest move and should be the most common move. It's the most instinctive one anyway. You want to expand in the center, you want to prepare castling, you want to get your pieces out. You know, e5 seems like the most logical move ever, so I would expect it most of the time. But even if we don't get it, I'll still try to get myself into the point where I get mated. Although my opponent is a bit confused, is a bit scared. He shouldn't be. I'm just a uh, 12.02 playing an unrated game. Yes! All right! And F3! Now is the moment of truth! Are they going to deliver mate? No, they didn't! Ah! I'm sorry, Mono Reborn. You are not getting a point from me. Andy Bigfoot, 15.23! Okay, a 15.23 should do me good there. Come on, G4, E5, E... Ah, oh, bloody hell. D5, who plays D5? We'll give him a chance. F3 now. Protecting the pawn, f3 is on some level a very instinctive move. Okay, they play e5. Are they gonna do it? Are they gonna? Yes, good job. I think for some reason, I think that people who play d5 are more likely to see the mate because then they're sort of reacting to my f3. I, I don't know, I don't know. It's 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 unclear, it's unclear, and uh. Yeah, we'll see if that persists. We'll see if that players who respond with d5 as opposed to e5 are more likely to see the mate. That's an interesting hypothesis to make, but so far, two out of four. 1327 from France. Okay, g4. Let's go. Let's go. e5. Nice. f3. Come on. Do it. Do it, baby. Do it. No? Yes? No? Come on. Easy. One move win. Instant gratification. Yes! Nice. Good, good. It's actually better than I expected so far. Three out of five. Not 100% as you would have liked, but no, no one is perfect. Let's move on. Okay, 1190 from Russia. G4. Zeta chess. Okay, nice. F3. 
What are the odds? What are the odds? What are they going to do? <laughs> oh, bloody hell. If only you could see it in the chat. He literally wrote five uh, five question marks. You know, that, they were really surprised. Okay, four out of six. You know, four out of six is much better than one out of three, I'm going to tell you. Yeah, the opponent was surprised. Delivered the mate anyway. Good job. 1497 from Spain. Let's go. G4. We're just literally E5. Nice. F3. Let's go. Let's go. Are they going to do it? Nope. Nope. Like, you never know. The raising disparity is absolutely shocking. And 1190 saw it immediately. Like, didn't even flinch. At 1500 almost. Didn't see it. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. You know, it depends. It depends. As we can see, four out of seven. Yeah, so we will see. We will see. Because it's interesting on the surface my opponent's play from the last game made sense they played e5 and d5 ignoring the mate completely but you could say well they, they they're capturing the center okay e6 is still fine with me i'm gonna play f3 probably should have played f4 f4 is a bit more innocuous looking but that's okay that's all right let's see if they know it that's that's very 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 intriguing all the time good 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 kudos to Ajay Kumab from India. 1273 from India yet again. Very close rating. Very close rating, but will there be an identical reaction? Okay, nice. E5. Now F3. Are we going to see mate? Are we going to see mate? Or not? Or not? They're thinking. They're thinking. They are confused. Are they confused in a good sort of way? Question mark, I'm getting in the chat. If they type in question mark, I, I know you don't see it, guys, but if they type in question mark, surely they know what's going on. Well, just play the move. Play the move and do stats a favor. Good. They just did. Brilliant. Manuel, 1255 from Spain. Okay, good. Good, good, good. So far, so good. Six out of nine, I think it's a very good stat. E5, brilliant. F3, and now here comes the moment of truth. Nope, 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 no. Yet again, no. What is it? Is it a second Spanish player in a row to miss mate in two? Hmm. Hmm. Are we reaching some sort of conclusion? No, nah, I don't want. I don't want to assume anything. But you know, Spanish players, uh, you're gonna step up your tactical game, I guess. 6 out of 10 it is going to be. Okay, a 12.43 from an African country I don't recognize. Zimbabwe. Okay, I apologize. I'm not very good with African flags. Shame on me. J4. Let's go. Let's go. They're thinking. They're thinking. This is uh, D5. Okay, okay, okay. We're still gonna give it a try with G3. Just protecting, mate. Just protecting. Knight C6. Hmm. How can we force something like e6 or e5? Let's see. Let's let's just play d4. See what they do. See what they do. I mean, they have to play e6, e5. Yeah, there we go. There we go. That's a good job. Okay. And this is his only chance. This is his only chance. First of all, I need to block my king. Sorry, I need to block my king so that this is going to be mate if he plays it. This is their only chance to mate me if they so wish. Yes. Good. Good job. Good job, good job. They saw it, they saw it. Africa is strong, <laughs> as opposed to Spain. Okay, 7 out of 11. 7 11, good. 12 15 from the USA. Okay, G4. Every game is just like a box of chocolate. You never know what you're gonna get. Okay, nice. E5, F3, come on. Come on, come on. Ah, bloody hell. He bloody missed it. He bloody bottled it. And it's. No biggie, no biggie, no biggie. Well done, mate. 7 out of 12 goes into our statistics. 12-11 from France. Okay. Oh, instant D5. Bloody hell. Okay. Are they then... It's either they know what they're doing or they don't know what they're doing. F3. Just protecting. Just protecting. No ulterior motives there. It's all fine. It's all good. I am just defending my position. Okay, e5, that's getting nice, that's getting nice, knight c3, and, come on, yes, yes, good job, good job, good job. Good job from a 12-11 from France, most rat types, oh one, you have my respect. Okay, 14-02 from Ireland, 
Ah, uh, guys, I hope this video isn't too boring to watch. It's literally the same move all over again. G4. I'm, I'm trying I'm trying to make it as entertaining as I possibly can, but I'm not the best comedian. I'll tell you what. E5. Okay. F3. We're nearing an and of research. Come on. Come on. Iron strong. No. Ireland not strong. 8 out of 14. 1260 from India. All right. Okay. <laughs> G4. I just hope that my account doesn't get banned or anything. <laughs> I don't know if I'm getting any reports for that. Some weird activities happening for so many games in a row. E5, F3. Okay. Let's see what they do. Indians, I think Indians have been pretty good so far. Yes, and they don't disappoint. And they don't disappoint at all. 9 out of 15. 60% so far. 2 out of 3 to simplify. That's a very interesting stat. Let's see if it persists till the very end. Let's see. A 13, a 1 from India. Let's go. Let's go. E5, F3. India has been very good so far, as far as my memory goes. Ah, nah, nah, not this time, not this time. Better luck next time. But yeah, it, it apparently doesn't even matter about the rating too much. We've seen some... 1100s, well, not 1100s, but 1200s pretty much see the mate almost instantly, and we saw 1300s, even 1500s not see the mate. And that's very interesting, actually. I think it's a very good indicator of how rating is somewhat only relative. A 1554 from Italy, come on, that's the highest rating I think we've had. This video, I'm not sure what exact rating the guy had with 1500 before that. Okay, D5, that's not a big problem. I'm going to play F3. F3, see what they do. I think they, they're going to see it. I think they're going to see it. They played E5, they're ready. Yep, yep, yep. Italy strong. Italy strong, 1550. Sorry, of course I'm joking, guys. There is no correlation between your country and your skill level. I'm, I'm just joking. I hope you're not taking it way too seriously. All right. We have a, well, an international from the planet Earth. R-A-S-O-P. Don't know what that means. E5. Good. F3. Are we going to get it? Are we going to get it right into our faces? Nope. Nope. Planet Earth is losing to Planet Mars. That's where I'm from. Yeah, that's for sure. Yep, this is going to be 10 out of 18. 1367 from India. A lot of Indians. And that's very good. That's very good. Also, unsurprising, India has a very big population. D5. Okay, F3. We learn how to play against it. <laughs> that's going to be the new Grob Theory. G4, D5, F3, the best combination of moves and now as someone who plays d5 yes i would expect him to play mate yeah i think he's 1600 bloody hell i'm playing against some really good people g4 d5 okay we've known how to handle this we've known how to handle this f3 and now i would expect e5 and bay honestly e6 also does the job for me come on yes okay now to be honest, 1600 seeing that is far from surprising. Very good job by my opponent. Very good job. And that, ladies and gentlemen, takes us up to a grand total of 12 out of 20 maids delivered. And yet again, we arrive at this stage where it's 60%. And it's very, very interesting, I think. 60% is the number that has been following us for a while throughout this video. And look, we ended up getting exactly at that number. And I think it's a very interesting and on some level very logical finding that people that play D5 as opposed to E5 on move 1, they can then with high likelihood to find that May because they have more time, again, as I said, to assess the position, to look at the weaknesses, to look at the obscurity of F3 and analyze it. But, you know, at the end of the day, I think all the 20 games have been very well handled by my opponents in the first couple of moves. That is because even the guys that missed made, they were doing so because they were cognizant of good, solid opening principles, such as taking over the center, you know, 
most of the times that the mate was missed, they played d5 and e5. So they were trying to just take over the central squares and have more control. And that's perfectly fine. There's nothing wrong with that. But at the end of the day, I think it's very important for any chess player of any level to be able to identify threats immediately because you never know next move you may not have time or an opportunity to actually deliver that threat take a deep breath and remember that when there is a good move always look for a better one e5 and d5 in those positions where guys were missing mate are good moves but you always need to strive for best and yes guys please let me know in the comments if you'd like to see more of such experiments and that is going to be it, my favorite unintentional gambiteers. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And as per usual, may all your chess moves on the board be exclam moves and have an excellent day. Love you guys. See you in the next one.